from Minnesota's most watched station. This is WCCO 4 News, live at the Minnesota State Fair. Hi, I'm Nathan with your WCCO newscast live from the State Fair. We want to begin today at the haunted house where WCCO anchors Frank and Chris have gone in but have not made it out. Witnesses tell us the two looked ready for just about anything as they went through the front door. But that was four hours ago. A search party has been sent in. They heard Frank and Chris screaming but have not been able to find them. A mummy on the second floor tells WCCO he saw he saw the couple about an hour ago, but the pair jumped, screamed, and ran out before he could grab them. We will continue to follow the search and let you know what happens. But right now, let's get a look at the weather and traffic. Well, thank you so much, Nathan, and uh, you keep us report up to date on that, all right? Is your sister going to visit at all with us or not? <laughs> Just us? Okay. Record numbers of people on the streets. We are seeing some backups on Judson Avenue near the Miracle Birth Center, where Ashley the cow is expected to give birth really any moment. Things are also getting congested on Cooper Street right outside of the Lumberjack Show. There are also some reports of a family weaving in and out of traffic. That's not good. It turns out they couldn't wait to try the new bacon fluffer nutter. As for this beautiful stretch of weather we're having, it is expected to last all week. Nathan, back to you. We want to... We want to update you now on our top story. Frank and Chris have been found. The pair were hiding behind a coffin on the third floor of the haunted house. They are thirsty and a little shaken, but are expected to be okay. That's all we have time for today. I'm Nathan. Oh, this has been a WCCO4 news update from the Minnesota State Fair. Thanks for watching.